What's going on, Minis? This is another video brought to you by Mr. Atkins Auto. Uh, this one is going to be on jacking up a vehicle, uh, the front end of a vehicle, so you can do work underneath it. Um, I do my best to try and get the best video I can, but it's uh, a little tricky. First thing we're going to do uh, when you jack up a vehicle, always make sure it's on concrete, not on asphalt, because the jack and the jack stands will sink into the asphalt. Also, make sure you never jack up a car on a hill, because once you lift the front end up, especially front wheel drive car, it's going to start rolling. Speaking of that, the first thing we want to do uh, as we get down to work here is take our wheel chocks and put them behind the back tires. Now that the car cannot roll backwards because we have our wheel blocks behind the back tires, um, we are going to go ahead and start jacking up the car. Now, quick picture, if I can get rid of the glare. This is the underside of a car. This is the front bumper right here. And this is my support beam that goes under. And we have our control arms, driver's side, passenger side. Um, this Ford Escort is kind of nice because we have a nice lift point right here that uh, fits the jack really nicely. So our jack is gonna go under the front of the car right here. Once we raise the car up, these yellow points um, on the cradle are where we're gonna place the jack stands. So there's one right here, we're gonna put a jack stand there. And on this side, I'm gonna put a jack stand over here. So let's see how we can do this. You can use the foot pedal on the bottom of the jack to speed this up a little bit. And you need to make sure the jack is going to hit that center part right there, which is a factory jack point. And now we're going to start raising the car up. Now that the car is up in the air, uh, you'll notice the jack started creeping forward, which is what it's supposed to do. As the car goes up, the jack is going to slowly move underneath the car, which is why you want to make sure there are no cracks in the concrete, um, seams in the concrete that the jack can get hung up on. Otherwise, it might drag itself out from under the car. <laughs> On the right side there, you can see the yellow area right here. That's where we're going to place our first jack stand. You do not want to put your body underneath the car. Just use your arm, lift the jack stand up, and it sits about three quarters of an inch below that part. I'm not able to go any higher, so this is going to work. And when I lower the car down, this part is going to sit nice, right in the saddle of the jack stand. Alright, and I just placed the jack stand on the passenger side also. So now we're good to go ahead and lower the jack down in place. To lower the jack down, what you're going to do is on this jack, we're going to raise the handle up and then twist slowly clockwise. Now the weight of the car is resting on those jack stands. So let's take a look. Uh, 
you notice now the cradle is sitting right in the center of the jack stand that's how it should be on the passenger side though I see a problem as I shine a light up here Right here, I'm only sitting on the left side. I'm not sitting down in the saddle, and I can see an actual gap right over there. That's not good, so we're gonna fix that. All right, lifted the car up again. I'm gonna slide this over. That should be better. Lift it, turn clockwise. And now my car is sitting like it should on both of my jack stands. Now, before we do any work underneath the car, what we want to do is make sure it's steady. Do that. Push here. Push kind of that way. Give it a little shake. Make sure nothing's going to slip and fall. All right. The next part is we're going to lower the car down. To do this, we have to raise it up and take the weight off the jack stands. go and we want to make sure that I'm still lifting by the proper point right here which I am all right weight has now been taken off the jack stand once again without putting your body underneath the car reach tap the lever up Slide it out of the way. Same thing on this side. All right. Traditional jack, you don't have to lift, all you're going to do is twist, slowly twist, and let the car slowly come down. And that's how you jack up a car, safely position it and then bring it back down. Guys, thanks for watching, I always appreciate it. And if you wouldn't mind, hit the like button at the bottom. Thank you. Mr. Atkins Auto, out.